going to switch gears now from being Sam is the producer, uh, rapper, PhD, student extraordinaire, into being Sam is the intergalactic bounty hunter. Woo! Yeah, so it sounds like you have, you have heard of this other Samus, um, but just cheer, cheer to the sky if you have, have, have heard of the uh, video game franchise Metroid. Woo! Oh, God, that's so exciting. Um, those of you who have not heard of Metroid, that's okay. I say this at all of my shows. Anybody who's a real friend to you will teach you about the things that they love and not make you feel stupid for not knowing about them first. So who don't know anything about Metroid. It's this game I played as a little kid uh, with my older brother and uh, the main characters in this big armor suit. You can't tell what they look like. They're just kind of kicking ass throughout the game. You destroy this giant like disembodied brain called Mother Brain at the end. The armor suit comes off and you learn that this character is this amazing, powerful woman. And as a little girl playing this, I was like, what? This is the plot twist of the century. I was so excited at the possibility of a playable woman character. Um, and so when I grew up a little bit and started making beats on my laptop, I remember I would show them to people, and in particular, dude bros would be like, who made your beats for you, dude? And I'd be like, I made my beats. And they'd be like, no, who really made your beats for you, dude? And I'd be like, fuck you, I made my beats. So I put the name Samus not only because I love video games and uh, video game music, but also to me, she's sort of this amazing representation of pushing back stupid gender norms about what women can and can't do, what power looks like, uh, what prowess with technology looks like. That I made telling her story. So I need you to imagine that I'm in my intergalactic bachelorette pad and I get a call from the Galactic Federation and they're like, oh my god, Samus, everything is so crazy. Can you save us? And <laughs> just like that. And I'm like, okay, cool, but you're gonna need to cut me a check. They cut me a check. The check clears. I take on the mission. <laughs> so. Yes, that last part is very important. So after the check clears, I check my bank account, I sigh, I put on my armor suit. Um, so what you're going to hear is a song basically of me taking the mission, taking on the mission and heading on my way to whoop some behind. So even if you don't get any of the references, just know that I'm like on my way to handle some business. This is a track called Mae Jemison, named after the first black woman in the <laughs> That's them on the phone. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> now I'm ready. Yo. I'm the fifth element mixed with May Jemison. All these fake feminist kids to stay. Jet is man telling me it's suicide. Brothers do or die. I be fighting like Buddha Kai for you and I. I'm the fifth element mixed with May Jemison. All these fake feminist kids to stay. Jet is man telling me it's suicide. Brothers do or die. Fighting like Buddha Kai for you and I. I got a gold federation on the phone, so the mission, no audition for the role I'm out the door. I be anxious to attack, and see that's why they chose me. Heard a pussy cat, all these trolls look like Josie. Ups never cold feet, young still I'm OG. Someone who can run and turn the gun to the OG. Those who oppose me be loaded up by Cody. A bro smoking troll, drinking OZ. Some problems we won't escape if we bite our time. It's space pirates appropriating like Molly Cyrus. These metroids invading us like a rhino virus. Trying to get inside of our craniums like some kind of sinus. My modern science can't fight it, they tap the big gaps. All the kick ass making tricks snap like Kit Kat. Drop picking hats and a pimp slap like sleep back crack ribs. The laugh to my abs have a six pack. I'm the fifth element mixed with me. Mother Brain is crazier than Sephiroth. 